31 years ago today, I saw for the first time the lady who would later become my wife. I thought she was pretty cute. And I thought you were pretty American looking. We weren't in the United States at the time. We were in a town in Belgium. Um, I think I'm pronouncing it somewhat correctly. I think it's Genk. Um, we I don't were, speak Belgian. Yep. We were at an international um, conference for youth. And I actually, um, when I met her and I thought she was pretty good looking, I had no idea of the health challenges that she was undergoing. In fact, the reason she was there was in large part due to the fact that she had to take a break from high school um, because of her health problems. Yeah, it was pretty bad. And um, in fact, it was so bad that after we fell in love and, and got really serious, um, I tried um, talking you out to they're marrying me and um, uh, you went ahead with it anyway. Yeah, that didn't work, did it? Yeah. Good thing. Yeah. Why? Why is that a good thing? Well, so um, you had a specialized chiropractor, a Blair upper cervical chiropractor called uh, Weldon Muncy uh, in uh, Lancaster, California, and you thought it was uh, possible and even probable that he could help me. Yeah, I didn't really know that much about chiropractic, but I've been seeing a chiropractor since I was about 10. Um, started off with sinus infections that wouldn't go away unless I was actually on drugs until I got my atlas corrected, the top bone in my neck. Uh, and then I started getting well, and I knew that it was a little bit different than regular chiropractic and it had some wide ranging um, health benefits. So I convinced her to go get checked. And it turned out that for the first time of all the doctors I'd ever been to, he figured out the problem. I used to think I had pressure uh, underneath my skull right here, and I felt like I would have nightmares at night. I tried to explain it to doctors, and they said, that doesn't happen. Except in this case, he checked me and he said, you have a bone out of alignment right here, putting pressure on nerves. Uh, my eyes welled up with tears. I was so happy that somebody finally found something and um, after a very light adjustment, I slept through the night for the first time ever. Years. Yes, and um, I slowly started to heal. And then I got a job for him, and the exciting part was I saw so many people who also got better. Uh, yeah, and then she started coming home and telling me these stories about people who are getting better, and I was studying economics, which I found interesting but not exciting. And uh, I started to get excited and thought, hey, I'm, well, I'm good with my hands. I want to help people. Um, I want to be my own boss. And um, we can live anywhere in the world instead of right next to a Blair chiropractor for the rest of our lives. And uh, so I ended up changing majors and going to, to chiropractic college and um, becoming a Blair upper cervical chiropractor myself. Yeah, so right now we feel like uh, we're partners, even though I'm not a doctor. Um, we work uh, very closely together. Um, Gordon is uh, super great with detail, which you want in a doctor that's going to take care of your neck. Um, uh, I'm very whimsical, but I love to talk to people. And between us, um, we have a great passion of helping you the same way that we've been helped. So I hope that um, you can see a little bit of the passion that we have and um, uh, if you want to find out if there's a possibility that maybe you can have the same help that um, that we received uh, give us a call I will talk to you usually unless you want to talk to Gordon in which case he will and then if you want to come in and actually get checked then he, he'll check you yep we do screenings first it's not a whole big appointment it's not an adjustment it's not a bunch of imaging first we just want to find out is this something i can help you with and it just takes a few minutes give us a call